Welcome back, guys, to Fire Emblem Engage. Well, last episode, our defense of Brodia Castle in Chapter 8, Kingdom of Might, began as Ivy sent forth Pegasus Knights to reach the gates, which Ulcris took down one by one with a blister before we took out the enemy princesses' two retainers, Kagetsu and Zelkov, leaving just the royal and a few scattered troops as we now look to claim victory. Okay, with the two extras taken off as we pick up another surge here. Thinking of just moving to here so I can trade items. Uh, do you want an iron great axe for a wind? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not a great trade, but. We got peg over here and a caster over here with fire. 12 attack. Barely any res. Should be more than enough on that side of the map. <laughs> Suck up the goods and we'll just lie in wait. But whenever it is that we have to perform the final attack on our boss. I feel wonderful. Slow but steady is winning this race too. Good dodge. <laughs> the fact is, she's adjusting her javelin throw for the next shot that comes in after knocking the opponent away. Ah, you cheeky git! Such tenacity. All right, I'll step in. With this ring, nothing and no one will take me down. Uh, as long as you stay back there, I'm fine with that. What's your uh, special talents with this ring, by the way? doesn't give you extra movement that I know of, right? <laughs> as soon as you move in, I'm going to shoot you down. I will wreck you. That is my honest and earnest plea. You should leave. But yeah, sneaky boy over here is literally just trying to get around us from the outside. <laughs> okay, that laugh was, uh, weird. We got plus one magic! <laughs> HP in a defense, I guess the defense makes us, uh, have some longevity that we didn't have before. I am slightly wondering about what's going to go on here. So we're going to want several people to be relatively in range. Have I actually used you yet? Oh, you could have popped that peg. I just didn't even pay attention. That's where you get double movement or something, and I'll be really unhappy. Oh, only one hit. I mean, to be honest, one hit on a peg with uh, nine res for 17 ain't that bad. Only one. It's like, uh, when you look at it, it's a pretty good return. It's uh, pretty nice. <laughs> Have we grabbed all the items off, guys? Seemingly. Everyone left is on the left side of the battlefield. Yeah, a little heal here. Hey, thanks. Yes, I guess no matter what, everyone's in position apart from our divine dragon. If she moves up, which she did. <laughs> so I think we know why this yellow one's here now. <laughs> Okay, so I literally cannot be counted. 
which is interesting. Flying Dragon's the correct one for fighting the rest of this when you think about it. Elm Attack is available, but I'm assuming that's going to be somewhat after the fact. Ah, that's, that's very annoying that none of my sword guys are anywhere near in position. Got way less people in position than I thought I would have as well. I mean, we probably should start here. I'm guessing iron bow... Oh no, only the steel bow is enough. With this emblem's strength and my own, there will be no defeating me. <laughs> I shouldn't have said that line. Yeah, maybe. In terms of what we got here to fight you with, you hit for four supposedly, but the killer axe is not exactly tasty. Uh, we do know as well that no matter what the range is of our opponent, it will counter with something at range, except it will be fire, which does not work out very well for her and puts two stacks of poison on her, which means that this would also be... This would, well, we've got the win now. That would be zero damage. Wait a second. What, what, what boy hit chance have I got on this one? 100%. I think all I do is lined up. One total damage. Is that really true? No, 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 no! Don't do that! I, won't you. I haven't killed the mages yet! You, Naka! You're too good! No! The ring! Well, old oh, Chris got the MVP! You, Naka, decided I want the experience. Did she drop the ring? Convenient. Oh, play for 12 hours. Go me. The interesting thing here at the ending of this is that uh, I defeated the boss enemy of that stage with a thief, <laughs> which again doesn't feel like a normal scenario. We recovered the ring, but the emblem is tainted with fell dragon energy. I'll have to summon him again myself. Free us, emblem of genealogy. I am Leaf. Thank you for letting me swing a sword with these arms again. I will do what I can to retrieve that which has been stolen. Thank you, Leaf. How could I have failed? It's over, Princess Ivy. Surrender. I will not. There is more for me to do. She's gone. Your Highness, urgent news from the border. What is it? An Aleutian battalion stands at the ready. King Hyacinth is acting as general. He's leading their army himself. What? Yes. And he is demanding to see King Morian. <sighs> I must face him. Anything less would bring dishonor to Brodia. Father, he's baiting you. This may be a trap of some kind. Go back inside. Ha! I could fight my way out of whatever trap he springs. 
I urge you to reconsider. Listen, who's the father and who's the son here? Stop trying to protect me. <laughs> son, this has been happening a lot lately. What's it all about? Are you worried Brodia might lose this war or lose its king? <sighs> We're not ready for any of this. Brodia to lose its king or me, my father. Diamond. From a young age, I was told I would lead Brodia after you died. Imagine, a boy forced to anticipate his father's death. To think of that empty throne. The Fell Dragon has returned. War is here. The future is uncertain. And I'm not ready. It's all right, Diamant. If I die, I die. Brodia will live on. But, father... What? You don't believe me? After I'm gone, I know you will lead with a steady hand. Though, I'm offended you expect that day to come so soon. You think I'm gonna lose, huh? You think I'm weak? That I need your protection? Oh, the hubris of youth. That's not what I meant. King Hyacinth awaits me on the field of war, his army at the ready. If Brodia hides, then what? After years locked in battle with Illusia, will we reveal ourselves as cowards? Listen to me, Diamant. I will fight bravely for Brodia. I do not fear death. Being known as a king who runs from battle, that scares me far more. <sighs> what do you think about this, Alchrist? Me? If I die and Diamant alongside me, you will take the throne. <sighs> Father, don't say that. I... I will not let that pass. I will protect Diamant to the bitter end. Oh, Christ. Ha <laughs> ha! That's my boy! Diamant, you could learn a thing or two from your brother. Fear has no place in my kingdom. If we step into fear, then we step out of Brodia. <sighs> now then, to the border! It seems I can't dissuade you from this path. All I can do is walk it with you. Come on, everyone. Let's show Illusia why we're called the Kingdom of Might. Haha, <laughs> that's it. This won't be the last time I see the castle. And when I'm back, a tournament with our strongest warriors. That means you, Divine One. Me? Yes, I want to see you transform into a mighty dragon. Whoosh! Roar! Oh, well, okay. What's the matter? Ah, oh, nothing. You're right. I could turn into a dragon. Haha! <laughs> I'm looking forward to that. I'd like to spar with you too, Divine One, after a father gets his chance. But that's for later. Now, we should prepare for our journey to the border. Indeed. <sighs> this talk of turning into a dragon... Mother could. Can I? I have no idea if I can. Or how. Ooh, 30,000 gold, thank you very much. Helps that I already donated your place, doesn't it? Yeah, I guess he never really thought about it before. Can I become a dragon or not? My mum was one. Uh, I just imagine him in a corner now gurning so much that he almost like, uh, ooh, my bowels. I don't know. What would you do? I feel it's always that thing like, I go, uh, I was trying to make him turn into a dragon. Then you do it in an appropriate place. You're on the, you're on the loo. <laughs> it just happens. Oh, well. Broken everything. 30,000 gold, though. A family that doesn't want its father to die, but will step up to protect it. That fear is true. We'll make it not come to pass. Or will we? Two armies going to war. That's dangerous. The danger of a live battlefield. Our party keeps changing every, like, bell, though, doesn't it? We've still got, like, our usual... we still got Clam and Fram, I guess, but... Things have changed ever a bit. Alfred's just too good, though. Hey! It's you, Divine Dragon. Such a thrill to meet you. I can't stop shaking. Oh, I'm Amber. Yeah, 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 but you're not Alfred, are you? Hey! <laughs> Sorry. Not that I'm trying to be mean or anything. Oh... While taking different approaches to security, Brodia Castle is impenetrable as the Somniel. See, he has info for us. Hmm. 
time has finally come. When preparations are done, let's head straight for the border. Hey, I've got my summon yell visit to do, you know? Once preparations are complete, we will head for the illusion border without delay. Tons of delay, I'll have you know. Yes. Rodius' castle design is second to none, but in the end, the castle's only as strong as his soldiers. He looks better than Alfred? No, 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 no. Alfred just can't put on muscle. Can't hold a guy back for that. That's right. Thank goodness the castle is safe. It's been like a home to me. If it were destroyed, I'd fall apart. <laughs> Checking to see if anything was damaged. The crack in the wall could turn deadly in battle. Good. What's Sean up to? Hey, um... It's probably safer to be on the sidelines, but I still really want to fight alongside you again. Oh no! They're talking that I'm not with them and trying to give me fragments. Ah. I learned a lot from our fight, Brodia Castle. I should tell the other raw soldiers about it. Don's like, you haven't used me. How could you do this? Why'd you hate me? I don't hate you. I just have to manufacture a use for you. Of course. <laughs> Battle with Lucia. I can't let anything happen to my father and brother. I have to stay focused. I'm sure you will. You're the MVP, by the way. Of course. Don't give me any crystals, aren't they? Oh, we'll get them when we leave anyway. Two steel ingots at the blister. Hmm. It's unusual to let outsiders see the inside of our castle, but you're our allies, so I guess it's okay. That makes me not an outsider then, doesn't it? Yeah. You did the math. Yes. Lucy doesn't stand a chance against Brodia. Our king will come home with their king's head. I wonder about that. Yes. Fine one. Please bless Brodia for victory against our enemies. After all, this attack on the castle itself was, um... A little too daring? Suspicious? <laughs> there are many words for it. Yes. How many illusions, your army, do you, divine one? I can't stand Elusia. Oi! Pardon me. I'm gonna patrol the castle grounds. Pity the enemy if I find the slightest sign of them. There's a market for Brodia Castle Soul. Nah, maybe too soon. I'll file it away for later. What? Wow! I'm a hero in a fairy tale again. Most of our guys, of course, will just give us the the goods. That seems to be this place. There's no animals to adopt in the castle. To the Somniel? Well, we know there's a cutscene before we go. We'll return soon. I leave Brody a castle in the Royal Guard's capable hands. Yes, your majesty. You can count on us. Done a fine job protecting it all these years, haven't we? We won't start slacking off just because you're not around. Excellent. And when we return, you'll be treated to a victory feast. Looking forward to it. See you soon, your majesty. Strong of body. Strong of heart. All right. Time to head out. Here we go. They're wrapping up their goodbyes. Yes. On to the border. Oh no, how do I recruit this armored lady? This armored older lady? Or just Silverhead? With a gemstone name. Quick, everyone chase Somni. Okay, of course, in between battle, we end up with more supports and more things to do. So one of our supports is at the top. We got cooking, we got other stuff. Uh, I'm not sure I saw the fishing marker before, but now fishing has appeared. Maybe I missed that before? <laughs> Maybe I didn't. But it's there now. Obviously, I had to gain a more dead-on way of catching fish than yes. using cats. <laughs> I have Anna's permission to tend the orchard. I do believe this fruit would go well with tea. Do you now? Louis? What are you doing there? Oh, hello, Divine One. I wasn't doing anything of note, really. Merely observing those two over there chatting with one another. Um, okay. 
And you're doing that... why? That is the question, is it not? There are all sorts of philosophical implications to the simple act of asking why, to which I suppose I would respond for edification. So you watch people chat in order to learn things? Precisely. There is deep meaning in these seemingly simple encounters. Through observation, many delightful and subtle details reveal themselves. When one treats them as one would treat a gallery piece, can there possibly be any harm? There, uh... I think maybe there can. What's right or wrong goes beyond rules and laws. There's courtesy and decency. If you knew they didn't like being watched, you'd stop, right? But of course, Divine One. I would never elevate my appreciation above their own comfort. Just so we're clear. Well then, I guess I'll leave you to it. Very good, Divine One. I trust that I have eased any concerns you had. He's very much a people watcher, isn't he? Equally, is this why he became an armor knight? Because he has to stand guard in big armor for a while, and he could just be in his armor and just... Yeah, I'm just watching people, doing the thing I like to do. Oh, it's that way. Sorry, out of the way. I'm coming through. I don't want to run you down. What if it was made faster? It would chase me everywhere! Ooh, I went all that way for some poo. Excellent. Okay, fishing is a thing. Since when? Since net just now. Okay, cool. You are now able to go fishing! Hmm? I've just bought a fishing, is it? Uh, sure. Fish guide. Oh, there's 20 different kinds of fish to catch, and they are actually at different times with different rods. I guess this counts as night, right? So, one with a modest rod, one with a sturdy rod, two with a sturdy rod, two with a supreme rod, but I don't have them yet. Yes. This is Prince Diamant who fishes. You can now fish in the pond. Press A to cast your line. Keep an eye out for the ripples big fish make. Press A when the fishing float drops to its lowest point to hook the fish. If the fish struggles, tilt L opposite to its movement. Reel the fish in or it will escape. Once you reel the fish in close, press A repeatedly to reduce its endurance. When its endurance falls to zero, you'll catch it. New fishing rods can help you catch bigger fish. Pick a rod. I guess the modest rod is all I can... I can fish with some as well. What were you thinking? I don't know. I see a ripple. Okay, I don't remember what buttons to press. I'm guessing I say. Am I supposed to press it when you're touching it? Are you not going to drag it under? No. Okay, thank you. <laughs> So only when it's in the blue strike zone can I pull it properly. Just pull the opposite direction. Oh, it's regaining its stuff. Oh, I can just pull it anywhere. It's just that's the safer zone. Good catch. Nicely done. A mycene eel. Its slimy body makes it difficult to remove from the hook. It is popular for its savory flavor. Get bone fragments for fishing. 69 centimeters. Do you want to keep going? Pick a rod. I don't know, do I? Bonus. Where were you thinking? I think here, maybe. It's just gonna be eels at nights, right? No! That was fast! It's a small shutter this time. Oh, I got it in a kill zone or something then. 
He got tired out. Super tucker. I suppose fishing isn't all about results. A big ice sardine, a small fillet, a fish that protects itself by forming large schools, easy to clean by hand. Do you want to keep going? Pick a rod. No, do I? There's still a other fish. It says bonus on it. Where were you thinking? I want the other fish. Else that he shouts now at me, so I could just like go look no. at, <laughs> look away. Poor fish. I'm assuming it's another sardine. I suppose fish. Oh no, I got the jarwell. That's the results. bonus fish. Its long beak occasionally breaks. Minced fish. The meat is often ground due to all the small bones. Come back soon. Did activity ten times. Oh, I only get three attempts. Well, I guess this also counts as morning too, then. How do I get fishing rods, old man? <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Not, not that food, God. Tell me your secrets. <laughs> I need more fishing rods, stat. A pretty pebble. Alright, let's see if we can get Sami maxed out then for the first time. So now I've got to come back and fish every time as well, huh? <laughs> when have I ever been one to refuse fishing in a game? Has there been a time where I've refused fishing in a game? I don't know. Of course, not all games are created evil with uh, evil equal with their fishing mechanic. All right, Sami is at maximum friends. What does that mean, Sami? I mean, we got a new entry for you, I guess. Where do you exist in the book then? Vanda likes knitting, cleaning, fruit, quite places, balls of yarn, and writing. This is partly cat. Dislikes distractions from his work, parties, strong odors, oversleeping, and folk food. Oh, I guess he won't get on with a certain someone then. Oh, we got Fram up to gold on here. Hobby's divine dragon viewing, goddamn. Uh, talents, back handsprings, judging beats. <laughs> Background, distant relation to Vanda and her position through a devotion to the divine dragon. We're looking for specifically Sami. There he is. It's got a red and blue marker. So this is the first Sami thing. This is the second one. Its personality is gentle and spirited. It likes Elia, butterflies, soft things, warm things, trying new foods. Dislikes how everyone it's ever known up until now goes away eventually. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. Le oof. <laughs> Unica and Alfred of HP. So, where are you from? Oh, look at you, shooting off questions like barbed arrows out of camouflage. Sit an ambush like that, and you're liable to drag a straight answer out of me. Great, so let's have it. Uh, ding. Somewhere in, uh, Brodia? Oh, I see. Thanks for opening up. Listen, could I ask you to keep a lid and, like, eight padlocks on this particular jar? Things could get unpleasant for me if this gets out and folks start connecting dots. Gotcha. My lips are sealed. Thanks, Alfred. Look, I know you want us to talk more, but it's not quite that simple. It could get really bad for both of us if you ask me the wrong kinds of questions. Oh, uh... I've got a lot to hide. And I don't want to lie to you, but if you put me in that position, then I absolutely will. Because it's far preferable to the trouble that could find you if you learn too much about me. I'm sorry, that's how it has to be, but... No, no, I get it. I won't push you. I'm not out to make you uncomfortable. <sighs> I appreciate that, Alfred. Truly. 
But I said last time I wanted to talk more with you, and that's what I'm gonna do. It doesn't have to be personal stuff. We can talk about anything. Like our favorite flowers. Yes, love it! Henceforth, your brain's gonna be stuffed with obscure weapon factoids. Hemlock. <laughs> Yeah, well, that makes everyone more curious about it, doesn't it? So let's look at the people that she can support with in general. Citrine Louis Etty, Alia, and Alfred. It's an interesting group. Does it mean anything? I don't know. Time to theorize. No, 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 don't do that. Don't do it. Okay. So we've talked to uh, none of our new guests, but of course we've got to come by the farm to pick up our nuts, our fish. I literally should just switch this entire place to a to dogs. <laughs> that just feels wrong too. This is the dog metal factory. It turns out being, you know what I mean? <laughs> Doesn't seem. That good. No cats allowed. Just 15 dogs working to get me metal. <laughs> Gotta work, boys. <laughs> right. Last time I visited the Somniel, you were asleep. It's an honor to finally speak with you like this. Stop visiting while I'm asleep, people. It's pretty weird. Well done. This gift is exactly my style. I should expect nothing less from the Divine Dragon. Thank you. I gave you a gift. That is bribery. Leave me alone. <laughs> Stop coming into my room. Now that does the records hall. This does the same thing as the menu. Can I bribe people to stop coming in my room? That's just all I want in life, you know? Good to see you. Let's get right into it. I don't know. Do you do better strength What'll training be? now? How hard do you want to go? It's like you hate me. What'll it be? Just give me the stuff. How hard do you want to go? Push-ups is easy, isn't it? So do you think Unica is actually a royal from? Looking good. Brody and Ale. Perfect. I mean, the interesting thing is she does nice. have the link with uh, Citrines. So you'd probably have to build their Looking relationship good. to figure it out. Perfect. Unless, of course. Looking good. It's straight up told to Alfred. But if it's not told to Alfred, Citrine Perfect. would be the best bet. You've got this. If it is a tool. Looking good. So you may as well get the plus strength, right? Perfect. What would you say is the best stat here, really? Looking I'm guessing good. like maybe different difficulties give higher stats. Would you rather you got this. two HP, two Dex, or two Strength? Great job! I'm so proud. But like a lot of time, people would value the Strength because it at least allows you to hit. Let's do this again sometime. 